Miroslav Poche, a member of the European Parliament's delegation for relations with China, says any long-lasting and acceptable solutions to such a dispute should respect two main principles. At first, it has to be based on the whole body of international law. Um, second, um, only the peaceful means used um, in order to achieve final settlement uh, can be accepted. And I think that the nature of disputes over the South China Sea is very complex. And uh, any single ruling cannot provide uh, all encompassing answer to a large number of problems which uh, we are facing in this case in the South China Sea. So I believe, however, um, that it in, in the context um, in, of international institutions, uh, they should play a role and help all sides to find solution. Poche pointed out that the dispute between China and the Philippines is a bilateral issue, which can only be solved through direct dialogue and consultation. He added that the international community, including the European Union, should encourage both China and the Philippines to engage in direct negotiation as soon as possible. Um, we all appreciate the both sides stands for peaceful solution. Um, it's important because the ruling of permanent court uh, of arbitration cannot uh, solve the whole dispute. That's definitely. Um, so at the end, it will depend both on China and the Philippines uh, to find a long-lasting solution uh, to their dispute in, in the sea. Uh, and, and it must be acceptable for both sides. Um, and international community can only help or facilitate somehow uh, the process, uh, not be the arbitrator.